Hi everyone, welcome back to Rich Reviews and you join us in the hills above Formio in Italy searching out our fuel station to fill up our tanks and then we'll be on to our first pass of the day where we'll take you along and you'll rejoin us on that first pass. just exiting Lavinio, we've come through Lavinio again so we've had to track back from Bormio to head on on to Bois in France. So we're just tracking back in another tunnel guys. <laughs> to be some of the most exhilarated driving I've ever had. All those tunnels and fast pace through the tunnels. 
absolutely incredible some good flowing sections there as well this just gets better and better absolutely amazing just got you've got to be careful you've got to keep thinking all the time that this car's got to get me home and we did have a, did have a weird sound a weird piss, piss sort of sound not pissing sound a weird piss sound and we we stopped because we weren't too sure what it was it was the flipping water bottle we've got a big water bottle here because my son and i drink a lot of water and it's it gets pressurized as you as you go up into a higher elevations and it was leaking air <laughs> made us think shit what's gone wrong with the car anyway everything's all right and uh we've calmed down now we've come into another beautiful uh, i think another like lower end skiing type of um village or town so when we find out what the name is we've got our signpost up there st moritz to the left we've already been to st moritz we're in Switzerland at the moment and then we're heading on through to France to Bois. So this is Fluella Pass that we're just about to drive drive along. And this pass is one we did yesterday. We're now doing it in the other direction. So it's going to be interesting. I, I think this was a good one. I mean, all of them are good, but um, it, different variants of uh, difficulty, really. side of that pass now and we've hit one of their microclimates again so roof up thank god for the smart top because i was able to put the roof up while we were moving a little bit and it's pouring down the rain now so i've got a manatino in wet mode at the moment because why not that's what it's designed for you can still drive a car fairly in a spirited fashion but it just means the traction control is going to be even more vigilant So we're heading on to a, an historic automobile museum called Mulhouse and we're going to spend some time there, just a couple of hours, just having a look around and that's on our way to Bois. Um, we're going through also Liechtenstein and Zurich to get ourselves there. <laughs> France, we're at La Belle Epoque, which is the hotel we're staying at here. And we've driven around 360 miles now from Bormio today via Mulhouse, the Mulhouse Automo Automobile Museum, Historic Automobile Museum. So we want to stop in there on the way. So 360 odd miles today, so that's pretty knackering. Um, one pass we covered off today, and that was on the way back through Lavigno. So um, we've now arrived here. Another day closed out, another great day, awesome miles, even though my 458 spider is now on, is now just about to clock over 15,000 miles. Some, some would say, well, I'm just gonna devalue the car. It's fantastic memory. So you've got to look at it from that respect. Awesome trip, still got loads more miles to do. Thanks a lot for watching guys. If you enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. Very important for the channel. If you're not subscribed, please thinking about subscribing. It doesn't cost you anything to do so. And we'll catch you in the next video.